algae goes in line with U.S. law and is legally allowed, as opposed to what you allow. So foreign governments can can absolutely keep making new accounts and keep botting and keep manipulating. They can even post things that'll go viral and then get banned. And not no, this is way Chicago. I got a. I still have my computer down. I'm in the pride. I had to move over here to do the video uh, from my desk. I'm replacing equipment over there, and it's a big pain in the neck. Um, and now the computer won't boot up my old one. So, anyways, that's how my week's going. Anyways, this is on again today, third time. Twitter's been on uh, Joe Rogan. I know I still have to address the uh, Joe Rogan, Alex Jones, and uh, what I think. Uh, Owen Benjamin, and I think Owen Benjamin was legit. I think he uh, he just gets caught up emotionally like I do. We're emotional kind of guys, and we get into what we believe in, and um, that's why I stepped back for a minute and, uh, and had to review everything, digest it. I don't think there's anything. I just think, you know, you, you can tell he's the kind of guy that still trusts people until they prove otherwise, and uh, you got to respect that. So, um, my opinion of Alex Jones, he hasn't changed. He's the same. Anybody who thinks he's the truth and all that, that's your opinion, and that's fine. And that's why people believe in Q and all that other stuff. If you don't think the government has caught a rogue group of guys in, in Q uh, telling secret info and all this crap, you can believe that, whatever. But back to this. I'm going to play this one section. The rest of it's a waste of your time because... This is a publicly traded company around thirty-one thousand shit, whatever it is. They are losing customers. Twitter is, and I shouldn't be focused on him, but um, anyways, they're losing customers. That's why they're on here so bad. They're losing market share and fast. They lost ten million people in the last quarter, and that's what they're telling people. Who knows what they're really losing? That means revenues are down. That means he even made a comment later that we can't afford to, to hire more people to to watch all these words and stuff they don't have the money so i think twitter is having a bigger financial problem than we may know about but i'm not a financial guy so i don't really care all i can say is i think that's why they're on joe rogan all the time and he stresses through this whole thing he doesn't care about throwing out one or two people that they know even if they're high profile he cares about more generating new customers because people are leaving scared that they're going to get picked on so that's his whole point but listen to what this lawyer She's a trained lawyer. Listen to what she's got to say care. about your, your rights as an American. Listen to this. And she slips up big time and calls it an American-owned corporation or something like that. Listen to this. Right. But a private American citizen can say, here's my opinion. I refuse to back down. I see what you're saying. You'll this is Tim Pool. He's a talk show podcaster. Uh, he would appear to most people to be right side of the center. He's not. He's proclaimed left side, but... Uh, the left is getting so crazy that he actually doesn't look left anymore. But let's go. We'll ban him. So we can see that at a certain point, you have a lot. You, 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 Twitter is slowly gaining, in, in my opinion, too much control from your personal ideology based on what you've researched, what you think is right over American discourse. OK, so he's telling them uh, you guys are full of shit. You're too big. And what he really should say is. Why he says the politicians may have to clamp down. She laughs. She's going to laugh at you in a second and say, I, I work with these politicians all the time. They ain't going to do shit. And she's right. Because they haven't done nothing. The president has done nothing about monopoly laws. He's done nothing about enforcing. If a platform starts regulating the comments, they become liable for the comments of everybody. That's why when you see uh, uh, that site, uh, ripoffreport.com, they tell you by the time you post it, they give you like three warnings. Once you post this, it's never coming down. Court ordered or not, we don't touch nothing. That way they're not liable for nothing. These guys, Twitter, Facebook, are not companies. Get that through your head. Both of them came up at the same time out of the middle of nowhere off a of military-based internet technology. Let that soak in, and then you'll see why she says this. Watch this say in the united states you are allowed to say what is legally acceptable period okay here it then comes lawmakers only choice will be to enforce regulation on your company no well, Actually, they won't do I shit spend quite a bit of time talking to lawmakers as part of my role I'm a head of public policy um spent a lot of time in dc i want to say that jack and i have Man, it's funny listen to what she says here and right here listen i think from the perspective of of lawmakers um they across the spectrum 
are also in favor of policing abuse and harassment online. They don't believe in the First Amendment. She's telling you what's coming. Listen. Things that people care about because they affect their children and they affect their communities and they affect individuals. And so I don't think that, and as as a private American business, we can have different standards than what an American government-owned corporation or American government would have to institute. Those are two different Whoa, 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 back that up. They affect their children and they affect their communities and they affect individuals. And so I don't think that, and as as a private American business, we can have different standards than an private American business. We can have different standards than what, and as as a private American, they're on business, the New York Stock Exchange. We can have different no, standards. This is than worse, what right an here. American government-owned corporation oh, we can have different standards than what an American government-owned. We can have different standards than what an American government-owned corporation. We can have. What has everybody been saying about the government alphabet? Business. We Google Alphabet, even names their company as after as the Alphabet Agency, American Alphabet. Business. We can have different They're laughing standards at you guys. An American government-owned corporation, or American government, than what an... She's a lawyer. They don't screw up their words like this. Or American government standards, than what an American government-owned corporation, or American government would have to institute. Now, Those are two different if things. you think... These guys going on Rogan is to get uh, you to think about not quitting their service or whatever. You're right. They're on there because their stock is going to drop more than likely because they're losing customers. So the fact that people are standing up is starting to get their attention. Start quitting the platform. Start doing what we think needs to be done. And other alternative sites will show up. Or they're going to straighten their shit out. Or... They don't give a shit all the way around because they're an American government-owned business. Wag Chicago. Just saying.